Welcome to HowSpeed.com, my name is Chrissy and today we're going to talk about the 2009 Alfa Romeo 159 GTA. The 2009 Alfa Romeo 159 GTA is built as a successor for the 156 GTA. The Alfa Romeo 156 manufactured by Alfa Romeo was introduced in 1997 as a replacement for the 155. Its distinctive style with high curved flanks made it to some the best looking car in its class. The GTA was subsequently stopped production in October 2005, citing poor sales, and the upcoming replacement to the 156 is the 159. The Alfa Romeo 159 is a compact executive car produced by Italian manufacturer Alfa Romeo since 2005. The 159 was introduced in production form at the 2005 Geneva Motor Show as a replacement for the successful Alfa Romeo 156. The new 159 GTA will feature rear spoiler, large low profile tires, and side skirts. Under the hood, the new GTA will have a 4.3 liter V8 engine. This engine will only weigh around 183 kilograms. The best part about this engine is that it has very limited amount of modifications and can still deliver 500 horsepower. Unfortunately, Alfa Romeo tried to keep the target horsepower under 420. It can do the 0 to 60 mph sprint in less than 4 seconds. The top speed will be limited to 155 miles per hour. The V8 will be mounted transversely. The 159 GTA engine will be matted with a wheel drive system and maybe even a sequential gear. Because of all this, the new 159 GTA will compete with German competitors. It will not only challenge them with its new engine, but also with its great handling quality and reliability. Who are these competitors? Well, it's been said that the 159 will compete with the 2008 BMW M3, Mercedes C63 AMG, and Audi A4. We have heard about these cars in earlier topspeed.com videos, where Car and Driver magazine compared these three cars and came out with only one winner, the M3. Will the new 159 GTA be the car next year to compare? And will it win? We'll have to wait and see. The V8 powered GTA is being tested at the moment and will be unveiled at next year's Geneva Motor Show. It will go on sale to the public in 2009. That's all we have for today. Tune in next time for more news.